A famous feminist once said, we realize the importance of our voices when we are silenced. That was said by Malala Yousafzai. We as women do not understand the power we hold together. We have been silenced for so long, but now we are stronger and will fight for what we believe in. Women have periods once a month and have to spend money to take care of our situations that we cannot control. Are you ready to take a stand and fight for what is right? To have free menstrual products? Do you really think that women should have to spend money on something they, they cannot control? No, ma'am. For having a period that they cannot control? No. They should be free. They should be free. So now let's dive into how much stress women have when we do not have access to pads and or tampons and other stuff around us. And also the dangers of having a pad and or tampon on for too long. So more than 70% of women feel stress when they don't have access to pads or tampons. 70%. 70% of stress that we should not have to have. Knowing that every time we go into a bathroom, there will be products there for us. I cannot stress this enough. We feel so much stress when we get our period. Oh my God, did I bleed through? Can you check for me? Oh my God, I don't have a tampon. Do you have one? Do you have one? And other people around you do not have one? This immense of stress, embarrassment, go and run through our bodies. Sometimes we have to even go through and you know, use toilet paper, which is something that is really not sanitary. 25% of women miss class because they don't have access to pads or tampons. Sadly, some have to result in using toilet paper, like I said, and which is very harmful for us because they have harmful chemicals in the toilet paper, which is something that we should not be using for that. So when I say this, I cannot stress this enough. Women have to go through the need of having to do these extra stuff when we shouldn't. And the talking about, you know, using stuff like that, using a pad and or tampon for too long can lead us to toxic shock syndrome, which is very terrible. Something that we shouldn't have to go through because sometimes we don't have access to another pad or tampon. So we're like, okay, you know, I'll just use this one for a little bit longer. It's fine. No, it can result to things like that. And that can honestly lead up to death. So moving forward from menstrual products, let's talk about how much it costs to be a woman and having to take care of this period. The average woman spends about $1,700 a year on pads and tampons alone, alone. $1,700 of money that has to be spent on something that should be given out for free. While we still have to worry about pads and tampons, we still have to worry about sanitary essentials which can run us up to $3,000, $3,000 on sanitary essentials, plus our $1,700 a year for pads and tampons, which is extremely unbelievable how much money we need to spend. Really, we're spending about $4,900, almost $5,000 a year alone on essentials for a period. And it only costs $4 per student and employee to be provided with menstrual products in bathrooms for women. We have to create bathroom equality for women so they do not feel like they don't have any support. Feeling the immense of stress and everything can be overwhelming for someone. So now that you've seen how much we spend on products and what they can ha do to us, you can see why we always want to be prepared but there are times when it comes by surprise. So the importance of having free and accessible menstrual products in bathroom and or work areas is because things like toilet paper and soap are essentials for people, right? Anybody that, you know, men use a bathroom, they have soap and toilet paper. That's essential, right? Women have periods. Having menstrual products should be essential and should be in the bath in the bathroom and should not have to cost $25 25 cents for something that they cannot control even so in california they are free but the dispensers are either broken or 
and never filled. It is extremely frustrating that people do not take these situations for women seriously. Why is that we always have to stress about having to have a pad and or tampon when they should be free and stocked up all the time? This should not be a problem. This should not have to constantly, you know, tell somebody and or have something filled. Women constantly fear and feel embarrassed when their period starts. They do not have to need to be feeling like this. People share their stories on how women should never have to go through situations like this from real people. So I'm gonna share a story. One time I was at a swim meet and my period started. I was complete, completely unprepared. I started to leak through my swimsuit and missed my races because I was hiding in the bathroom. This should not happen to anyone. Women should not have to hide in bathrooms. These things like this should have never been a problem. This is why, and I cannot stress this enough, we need free menstrual products. We need the basic essentials for and as a woman. All in all, you have seen just how much women get left behind when it comes to our basic needs. We all need to come together and let our voices be heard. I want to help and inform others of a problem we have let become normal. So today you've learned the reasons as to why is it extremely important to let your voice be heard. As a woman and as a man, you can speak up for women to have free menstrual products. So the importance of letting your voice be heard is that we as women have let, been let down many times and that is why we need to continue bringing awareness to our situations. These things cannot be left in the dust as why products need to be free in bathrooms. I myself have been in the situations where I did not have a pad nor tampons. Neither did my friends. I was extremely stressed and scared someone was going to see you know, my stains since I was at work and I was wearing khaki shorts, not even dark shorts where I can hide it. So women should not have to deal with these types of things. This amount of stress and, and fear that we have should not be allowed, which is why we need free menstrual products. Thank you.